Hey guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Infinix Note 10 Pro versus the Samsung Galaxy A12. And guys, and the Samsung Galaxy A12 is powered by MediaTek Helio P35 chipset with a 4 GP of RAM. While on the Infinix Note 10 Pro, we have a MediaTek Helio G95 chipset with the 8 GP of RAM. On the back, we have a quad cameras on both these devices. As you can see, we have a 64 megapixel main camera on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. While on the A12, we have a 48 megapixel main camera. So I am really, really excited to see that how is the Infinix Note 10 Pro is tap against the Samsung Galaxy A12 and the processor on the A12, it is a really, it's a very weak processor. So without any wasting time, let's get right into it. Now let's see that how much a difference between these two devices. And guys on both phones is competing off. So now let's start off with the boot up test between these two devices. Here we go. And the logo is here more faster on the Samsung Galaxy A12 as compared to the Infinix Note 10 Pro and guys and the Infinix Note 10 Pro it is running on Android 11 with the XOS while on the 8 well we have a Samsung One UI which is based on Android 10 no Android 11 on the 8 well and you can see Infinix Note 10 Pro it is much much faster when it comes to booting up while the 8 well is take a lot of time and you can see huge difference there and now the Samsung Galaxy A12, it is also done and you can see about 8 or 9 second difference, maybe more between these two devices when it comes to booting up. And guess you can see that and both phones has a very different display. We have a full HD IPS LCD display with a 90Hz refresh rate on the Infinix Note 10 Pro while on the A12 we have a 720p PLS TFT display on the, on the Samsung Galaxy A12. And also we have a 60 hertz refresh rate on the A12 and also we have a u-shaped notch while on the Infinix Note 10 Pro we have a punch hole which looks much better as compared to the water drop notch on the A12 so now let's see the app's opening speed and guys everything is closed up in the background no app is running in the background and also we have same wi-fi network on both phones and the first application we have is the phone dialer like always faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro as compared to the A12 so next on the list is the settings and that is more faster again on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. So now let's check out some more application. Now let's start off with the Amazon shopping. And also we have same Wi-Fi network on both phones, huge faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro and you can see huge faster there. No comparison between Infinix Note 10 Pro versus the A12 in terms of the speed. Now let's see the scrolling and that is feels really, really smooth on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. Again, we have a 90 Hertz refresh rate on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. So now let's check out some games application. Now let's start off with the Candy Crush Sega. Again, we have a MediaTek Helio G95 as compared to MediaTek Helio P35. And you can see huge, huge faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. Now let's see Instagram, faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. Let's see Spotify, faster again on the Infinix Note 10 Pro as compared to the A12. Let's see Subway Surfer and faster again on the Infinix Note 10 Pro as compared to the Samsung Galaxy A12 and also we have a dual speakers on the Infinix Note 10 Pro and A12 now it is also done and you can see huge difference there between these two devices let's see temper and 2 again faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro which is obvious again I have to say we have emitted a Helio G95 which is a really powerful chipset while on the another hand A12 has a very weak chipset but you can see that huge difference in the in this application as well now let's opening up the tutor faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro and you can see as compared to the A12 so last time I launched the cameras on both phones default camera app now let's see that which one is going to be the fastest one here we go faster on the infinix note 10 pro again as compared to the samsung galaxy a12 again we have a 48 megapixel main camera while on the infinix note 10 pro we have a 64 megapixel main camera and guys now let's see internet blown speed i am seeing default samsung internet browser on the a12 while on the infinix note 10 pro we have a google chrome so and the first website we have is the wikipedia.org faster on the Infinix Note 10 Pro as compared to the A12. Now let's see the scrolling and that is 
very smooth on the Infinix Note 10 Pro. Yes, in the start I see lags on both phones. So now let's open this. Faster again on the Infinix Note 10 Pro as compared to the 812. Now let's see the scrolling again. Very, very smooth on the Infinix Note 10 Pro, which is obvious because we have 90 Hz refresh rate. So guys, now let's see where I measurement on both phones. And this time I don't open a lot of apps. So now let's see that how is the Infinix Note 10 Pro is stack up against the 812. And you can see again, Infinix Note 10 Pro, it is automatically remove apps in the background. And you can see and the phone dialer and the settings, it is not available on the Note 10 Pro. So that's a really bad thing. Now let's see phone dialer on the 812. Let's see settings. No refresh. Now let's see Amazon shopping on both phones. No refresh again. Let's see Candy Crush Saga. That is... No refresh on the 812. Instagram. No refresh. Let's see Spotify. No refresh. Let's see Subway Surfer. You can see no refresh. And Samsung Galaxy 812 is performed really good in the wire management. Despite having a 4 GPO frame, let's see temper and 2. No refresh again. Now let's see the tutor. That is also not refresh. Last we are back to the internet browser where we left and you can see. And guys over I have to say regarding the app's opening speed. As you can see that and the Infinix Note 10 Pro it is a really really fast phone as compared to the 812. In system based application as well as in game app loading time. Huge difference between these two devices as you can see in terms of the RAM management device I have to say that Samsung Galaxy A12 is performed much better in the RAM management as compared to the Infinix Note 10 Pro so that's about it and thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy A12 versus the Infinix Note 10 Pro let me know your thoughts in the comment section below subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos follow me on Instagram and Twitter as well and I will see you in my next video peace out